Newton's second law says that forces cause acceleration. When you exert a force on an object, it will cause it to accelerate. But the amount of acceleration depends on more than just the strength of the force that, exert, that is exerted on the object. How the thing accelerates also depends upon a characteristic of the object itself called its mass. The acceleration of an object under the influence of a force, the acceleration is the force divided by the mass. That means that for the larger mass in the denominator, the smaller the acceleration given that the same force is exerted. I want to demonstrate that here for two different masses. Both of these uh, black balls uh, are going to be accelerated by the same force. And this is my standard force maker, a uh, gun like that. And each time I use it, it will exert the same force on these objects. And now the question is, um, how will they respond to that force given that they have different masses? The one that accelerates the most has the least mass. The one that accelerates the least has the most mass. And so let me just test them by exerting the same force on each of the two objects, one, in, uh, one after the other, and you observe their acceleration. Try this one first and then that one. Okay? Ha! Okay, well, you've got to kind of make a mental image of that to compare with what happens when I fire my gun at the second mass out here in front. So, ha! Nothing. Or at least very, very little. So the two objects do not respond in the same way to the same strength of force. Of the two objects then, which of the two objects has the greater mass? It's the one that accelerates the least. So the object that accelerated the least, this object, has the greater mass. 